Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you are using Google Gemini online, just to let you know that Google Keep and Google Tasks are now directly available in Gemini on the web. Now this hasn't rolled out recently. This actually rolled out a while back, maybe two weeks or three weeks ago. But I'm just making this video in case you're unaware and if you are tied into the Google ecosystem. Now how this all works is um, you just type at into the chat box and there we can see Google Keep, Google Tasks. And another thing you can do is you can just type at Keep or at Tasks. You get the idea and there we go. So you can just type that directly in and that will obviously bring up the relevant extension. And the nice thing about this is you don't need to jump over to another app. So you can use these services directly now within Gemini on the web. Now, with the Google Keep extension, if we use Google Keep, with the Google Keep extension, uh, some examples of what you can do is you can now ask Gemini to take down a note. Uh, you can build a shopping list. You can add to an existing to-do list. Just to mention a couple of examples, obviously there's a lot more you can do. And it can also... Um, tackle tasks based on what you have stored in Keep. So I'm just going to give you a very brief example for the purpose of this video. Um, there are other things you can try. Go fiddle with this um, using these two new extensions if you are using Gemini on the web. And obviously you can fiddle around and um, you know get try out some other examples. So I'm going to ask Google Keep to create. I'm just going to type this in quickly. Create a note. This is just a very simple example just to give you an idea for the purpose of this video. There we go. And show sure, what's the title and I'm just going to say test. And it'll take a second and there we go. So there's my test note created. And if I click on that, it'll take me directly over obviously into the Keep app and there we go. Uh, there's my test note just to demonstrate for the purpose of this video. So that's using Google Keep. Now using um, Google Tasks, and the nice thing about Tasks is you can now ask Gemini to create tasks where you can add details like due dates and descriptions, mark tasks as complete, and search for existing tasks just to mention once again some examples. So for this I'm just going to type in at Google Tasks, there we go. And it, just a very simple example just to demonstrate once again. So I'm going to say, remind me today at 12 to take a break. Sorry, I'm typing here with one hand because I'm multitasking. So it's taking a little bit longer. There we go, and there we go. I'll remind you at 12 p.m. to take a break, and if you click on that, it takes you directly over to tasks that's integrated, obviously, into your Google Calendar, and once that opens, there we go, there's my task. So that's just two simple examples. Once again, just go fiddle around um, if you are wanting to try out the new Keep and Tasks extensions that are now available uh, in the online platform, and I think this is a nice move in the right direction especially if you are tied into the Google ecosystem. It just uh, brings a lot more functionality uh, into the AI chatbot. And just take note though, there are a couple of things that you cannot do with these extensions. So you can't modify or delete existing notes, share lists, or uh, handle or generate images using these extensions, Google Keep and Google Task. But nonetheless, um, uh, it is off to a good start and I think this is a nice move in the right direction. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.